people don't understand most of it right they, exactly that's why most people that are on there they're crypto already crypto enthusiasts they already know how to buy exactly. bitcoin, bitcoin they already understand wallets more or less right and all that so yeah for sure totally agree somebody somebody and I don't know if it's Clouty or if it's bitcloud.com or if it's something else. Mm. Like bitcloud.com is a very specific thing. It is a non-custodial client for an expert user of the, the like Bitcloud protocol. Right. And I don't think that's the only type of client that there's space for. Um, and I certainly would stop short of building a custodial client, at least right now, because yeah. I think there's all sorts of potential challenges there. But I think that there's a couple assumptions built into the onboarding right now, some of which you can solve in a client, but some of which you need to solve in the protocol itself. Mm. So okay. the idea of, you know, so first of all, it's basically built with the idea that most people are going to come and bring money on platform. Mm. I think that's a fundamentally bad assumption for the other 99 million users who aren't here. Most mm. people will come on board without putting skin in the game. And we need to find a way for them to come on, deepen their relationship with the platform over time. Maybe they bring money in time. Maybe other money moves to them. Their founder rewards now paid in BitCloud. So they right. actually have liquid funds that they can use to kind of spread around. Right. Founder reward is probably one of the most ununderstandable concepts that I've tried to explain to kind of normal humans. Yeah. We need to figure out what the metaphor someone understands there is. Mm. And I think there may be ways of creating a bonding curve for founder reward, just like we have for coin issuance, where there, there's less need to manually manage it. Um, and then I think the, the ultimate thing that I think will, I think most users will be invited onto platform. Up until now, we've assumed that BitClout is a single player mode onboarding. It's been you go join BitCloud or their original growth hack, which was kind of pre-minting accounts for all the big crypto folks, was like, you go claim your profile on BitCloud. Right. I think tomorrow you're either going to be like invited to BitCloud by your slightly more savvy friend, or you're going to receive BitCloud and you're going to sign up to claim that BitCloud. And it's going to be an onboarding funny funnel that focuses on you receiving something, having the simplest possible kind of like onboarding to get somewhere on the platform mm. and then you figure out like oh i can buy other people's coins like when you receive your first diamond and you know then someone buys your coin and so you get a little bit clout and you're like oh what should i do with that it can be a much more progressive um onboarding mm. uh, some of them would need at, at least protocol changes if not potential hard forks right um but others i think you can completely do as um as a client and just right. kind of wrap it up in a in a better us yeah um, yeah that's a that's a problem i'd be really interested to to work on as well mm. yeah definitely definitely sounds interesting i mean uh, 